a bike. That's mad, mad deep, yeah. deep, yo. That's crazy. That's wild they deep. Make it. it's, it's hard to believe. Like today's the day we've been working, we've been preparing for for over a year. I want to try. By us persevering and putting all of our effort and not knowing what's gonna happen today or tomorrow or the next day, um, it kind of helps the cancer patients too to see us willing to take these chances and give it our all when we don't know what's gonna happen when they don't really know what's gonna happen a lot of the time. I think a lot of people are gonna gain a new perspective on themselves. I know a lot of the team had never cycled before February. I didn't even know what a road bike looked like. I knew there was a difference between skinny tires where you didn't go on wood chips and things like that. You just stuck with the streets and a um, mountain bike and I've always said a mountain bike. They're going to do it because they're highly motivated. Great team. People will, will learn that they can push some off beyond everything that they, you know, the limit that they, they once thought. Just, just their own capabilities and what they can do. I think this is a huge, a huge accomplishment for anybody who can complete it. The fact that they attempted it and that they've signed up for it for the whole trip is, shows something about their character. You know, being in a lab, I realized that there's just not enough funding for the type of research that needs to be done. Uh, killed by cancer. There's a few members of my family who, since I decided I wanted to do this, uh, have, have uh, been affected by cancer. A childhood role model uh, killed by cancer. He was only 26. Just decided it was time to do something big. My friends were really passionate about and that I wanted to contribute right, as much go. as I could. One thing that was amazing to me was that the pastor at the last church that we stayed at last night, he showed us all around the whole entire parish. Uh, his wife was cooking dinner for us in the kitchen and then and he left. It was time for the kids to go to bed and we basically had free reign of Just trust us to this the whole church. So we're going to go ahead and locate ourselves over at uh, Lake this lady went over to IGA and, and bought a bunch of food and is really excited about, about fixing us a meal. And uh, she's even going to put us up for the night in her backyard.